Hello gamers and game masters, what is going on? My name is Tanak127 and welcome back to another video. And guys, before we get into today's tier list, just a quick intro and letting you guys know what's going on. So first and foremost, the Discord stream we were recording, the tier list would always pop in and out on the um, on the Discord stream. So do forgive that, you're going to see a blank screen here from time to time. But the discussion and all the facts and you know what we're going over is still there. Also, special thank you and special shout out to Asylum for joining me with this tier list video. Make sure you guys go subscribe to this channel. It will be down in the video description. Enjoy the video. Peace. Oh, we're rating them from from S to F tier. What, all the Zen with Zone Zero characters? Yes. I'm still just trying to process that you're telling me Anne B is not an S. Because she's not. What the fuck is wrong with you? What about the Screams S tier? Oh, I don't know. Her face, the white hair, the skirt. That the S. White, white hair. No. There's no way she's S tier. Oh, man. Andy, at, Andy, at most, I would say, is B tier. What? Yes, Ambi is B tier. Oh, good God. <laughs> All right. Well, and don't say it's because she uses a sword either to neck. No, well, look, you know I got I got a soft spot for the sword waifu. All right, God. God damn it, to neck. <laughs> Cla falling for the classic anime trope of a girl with white hair and a sword. <laughs> Mid. <laughs> she, she's, she, there's no way she's S tier tonight. There's no, no. Way she's S tier. No. Why are you... She's not. She's she's not up here tonight. She, she, she does not compare to some of the other girls here. All right. Well, you tell or me. Other characters all right, in general. Want, all right. Okay. I want I, you. To, who is S tier in your opinion? Billy. Are you serious? What? He has great personality. His his gameplay is fun. And come on, Tanak. Hold on, I thought we were wearing a jacket. I thought we were talking about looks. Oh. I, I mentioned his looks. Robot wearing jacket. Now, come on. He also has white hair. If we're going with the white hair trope, oh, Billy beats out Envy by a mile. And he uses guns. In a setting in world where having range is better. Why the fuck would you run in there with a sword? <laughs> Just shoot the motherfuckers. <laughs> Billy, Billy gets it. Oh my god. So let me get this straight. If I sent you a stripper right now, a hot one, dressed as Anby, it wouldn't would affect you. Or, you would shut the door. I would shut the door. <laughs> Alright. You gotta put her in A. I kinda feel like she should be put in B. I'm compromising, putting oh, her in A. Oh my god. Fine. Alright. Okay. But Billy's Esther. <laughs> That's undeniable. You know what? Just cause Billy's Billy's a freaking man, we can we can leave him at S tier. There. Now unlike the bear, I I, I don't I'm not too big for No, don't don't bear. put no do not put that fucking bear in S tier. Oh my god. No, I'm no, I'm putting him in F tier. Yeah, okay. It's a it's a fucking bear. <laughs> I have standards, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I, I threw the bear in F tier. We don't give a fuck about the bear. It's a bear. Okay. Alexandria Tanek. This is the older, uh, one of the older uh, people part of the, the maid services. Uh, part, they're part of the Victoria Housekeeping uh, group. She's the, uh, the mage who has both lightning and ether. Alright. Where... where... Where are we putting her on this tier list? Alexandria. Uh, B or C. Yeah, I, I was going to say like mid to high B. Okay. So, yeah, I think B is a fair spot for her. Yeah, okay, I'll go with uh, that. Fuck, what, what's her name? Hang on. No, okay, it's not that. Da, 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 da. Ah. So, from the Criminal Investigation Special Responses Team, Zhu Yan. S.
out fast. Dude, I'm going to mention the handlebars on her ass. No, just listen, listen, listen. Play <laughs> her one time. All right? Oh, I did. Uh, okay. You, you, uh, like, even Aki agrees there's something about that ass. All right? <laughs> Yeah, you see, like, see, like, I was going to mention the handlebars on her ass, but before yeah. I even could, you were just immediately S tier. Yeah. Like, I would say, like, high A, maybe low S, so I should have yeah. to write, uh, I'd move her here, actually. Like, she's... We should have an S tier, yeah, but definitely, like, a low S, high A. Yeah, she's, she's cute, laughable, aggressive, and everything, and come on. See, I, I've been seeing memes of her. Uh, where she pulls somebody over and she has to fight back the intrusive thoughts of committing of uh, committing police brutality. <laughs> now, well, you'll grace. work with her a lot in chapter two. Oh, oh, that's oh, that's so reassuring. I get to see the handlebars a lot, don't I? Yeah. Oh, yes, plenty. Now, Grace. S. Yeah, what's faction is she part of again? She's part of the yeah, so she's part of the Grace is the first develop bog heavy industries, huh? Grace is the first S tier character I wanted, but dude, have you watched her character trailer? I have not watched her character trailer. I have played a little bit of her. I do like how she functions. Right. She has, she has bongos that compete with Nicole's, bro. What did he say? Michael, I, I, I know, I know. We we, we had aren't the biggest we, we had the, we had this discussion. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> And the way I'm acting right now, it's like I'm going to put every hot, either big ass or big titted character in S, but no. Fucking, oh, dude. Mainly her and Zuyan, I believe, both belong in S tier. They're mm. even they're even kind of similar gameplay-wise. Well, yeah, so they, both use, to... they both use guns. Well, characters that use guns tend to be similar in some sense. Yeah, and that's, I that's to, one, that's I need, one I need thing I'll actually... I need to explain myself actually... why I put the next one up there. Okay, there's actually going to be one other thing I'm going to say here, too, um, for people that are playing the game. If Billy... You know, if you never find a good S-tier gun character, Billy will do, especially if you fully awaken him. All right, Billy is yeah, the one I mean, A. You will be fine. Billy has been fucking rocking everything in my game. Shit, yeah, before you, you wake him, Billy like, is the strong. one, the one A tier character you will be fine with for the rest of your career in Zen Zone, Zone Zero. I can confidently say that the way the way yeah, that he's insanely good. Yeah, uh, but I feel like I don't need to explain myself as to why uh, Ellen Joe is up there. Where'd you put Ellen Joe at? What do you think? Oh, oh, oh cause you love her. She just gets the S spot, huh? Yes. I'm not hearing anyone. I'm not. I'm not hearing you say otherwise. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna. I'm gonna say something that, that might piss you off, but I'm just gonna say it anyway. Michael. <laughs> what the fuck are you about to say? <laughs> I will take. What, what is her name again? God. I forgot her name which, already. Which one? Shit. Zoo or Grace? Oh, no, or, no, no, or no. I'm, I'm on the game right now. I'm literally zooming through my characters. I will take Grace over her any day. You, you? <laughs> Bro! <laughs> and and in, even in game, they are side by side in the menu. Yes, I will definitely take Grace over Ellen. But that's just me. I, I that's just not acceptable. <laughs> Putting aside appearances, Ellen is a Spider-Man of the Zen Zone Zero universe. <laughs> no, and that's not a joke. Combat wise, she, Ellen will probably no, no, don't run fucking circles. say combat wise. You, you don't like scythes. <laughs> No, no, I was going to be honest. Ellen will probably run circles around Grace. Everyone has a plan until... The first, everyone has a plan with a gun until I'm within five feet of you. <laughs> you, you know, how, how about this? I, I lower her to being a lower ass than Billy. I, I put her literally next to Grace. What? No, 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 no. 
If it's your opinion, it's okay. What? You did um, you gave you gave Ambi the high A for me, so you can and, give and Ellen the, the high uh, S yeah, for you. Uh, uh, Billy's always always going to be above even Ellen. <laughs> You can't you you can't deny Billy has er, earned that spot. Oh man! <laughs> like I don't think there's any character here currently that can take high S from Billy. Right. Yes, unless they release someone in the future. If they do, then there's going to be the Toy Story meme meme of me saying I don't want to play with you anymore as I toss <laughs> Billy in the trash. <laughs> All right, Nekomata. I feel like Neko's hot, Neko. but she's not a S. She's yeah, she's yeah, she, yeah, she's not S tier. She's definitely not S tier. I, I'm trying to think if I want to put her in high, in high B or low A. You know what? Because like she could easily be a uh, high B. Yeah, she's. I don't know. She's really cute. She's fun to play. But she's just got that... I don't know, that, um... Is it the choker? Is it the, uh, what? The tattoo on her forehead that looks like a barcode until the <laughs> hair moves? I legitimately thought it was a barcode the first time I saw the tattoo. Yeah, that's what I thought. No, I was literally looking at her in-game. Uh... Is it the fact that she has two tails? No, just... I don't, I don't know what it is. She's cute. Don't get me wrong. And I even... I even had a crazy reaction to the trailer that... Made Aki send me a text going, Oh, really? <laughs> but... <laughs> um, no. Uh, I don't know. She's just... She's not S. You're, you're right. Low yeah, A, I, 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 I like... Yeah, like low A, high B. I think it's just a perfect spot for her. Yeah. Uh, I've seen the art for these two. Uh, unfortunately, I cannot see it because... Oh, because you don't uh, have them here. Uh, I have the site. Uh, okay. Da, 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 da. So they are both of the sons of uh, Clayton. Mm -hmm. uh, Piper, Wheel, and Lucy. Yeah, you... Uh, not very... Not not a whole lot for me to look at them and say, ah, yes. Right. Uh, so that's Piper Wheel. Again, not a whole lot going on. Not Also not a big fan of the style of pants. Like, why are those, why are those screws massive? There's no need to have them be massive. <laughs> so that so that's Piper Wheel, and then there's Lucy. Lucy tries to do, like, the biker, like, the punk biker aesthetic. Uh-huh. Uh, it, she's trying too hard. She has right. a bat that has brass knuckles built in. Piper, I don't know. She looks too much like a, too much like a kid to me. They they both look a lot like kids, and yeah. it's like, eh. Lucy like, looks a bit more mature bit, than Piper. But she's, but she's trying too hard. Yeah. It's just like you know what? Hear me out. They're both in D tier. Yeah, and good God, there's another thing Hoyo is doing with this game that is getting on my nerves. Oh yeah, what's that? Yeah, just making them lollies. No, 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 I'm not even worried about the lolly characters. There, there are some characters they just keep trying to hide their ass, and it's annoying. <laughs> like Grace, for example, <laughs> remove that stupid skirt. Uh, you want to look at their cheeks? <laughs> like, like God, they gave it to Zhu Yan. Like, come on. <laughs> Well, Zoo Yon's also wearing tight ass jeans, my nigga. Yeah, and, and another thing. The guy. Anby. She's clearly, if you look at the sides of her, she's wearing a thong or a G string. <laughs> but yet there are shorts on under her skirt. <laughs> like, come on, hold you on. You well. <laughs> <laughs> just, just as you just saying, hey, don't be afraid to show off uh, full on cheeks. <laughs> you just want to see ass. <laughs> Fucking perv. <laughs> I am not. That's what you are. You're a pervert. <laughs> uh, so the next two characters are part of the same organization that Zoo is a part of. Alright. So the the next one is Seth Lowell. Or, or Lowell. 
Oh, Seth, he actually comes out, I think it's um, sometime 1.1. Yep. Uh, I have not watched anything on him. He looks pretty average, to be completely honest with you. Yeah, he's a, um, he uses like, like, a, like he's a cat boy with yeah. a sword. But like other than that, yeah, he uses like a a sword and shield. Yeah, like like he's standard. Yeah, very uh, like there's, very very like very there's good. nothing like like if you were to, to say hey, go pick out this person in a list from like a jumble of lists. Like go find Seth. Mm-hmm. He'd be the most bland person there. Not much going. Not much to look at here. Right. Like, the only thing that he really has going for him are the cat ears. <laughs> as a unique identifier. Right. Without those, he's just a white-haired guy. So I'm going to say... I'm going to say C tier. Middle yeah. of the road. Okay. I think we both agree with that. Yeah, like, like he's not bad, he's not great, he exists. Okay. Uh, the other one, uh, but part of the same uh, organization as Zhu Yan, is... Quingi. I think yeah. I think that's how you pronounce it. Yeah, it's how you could, it's like Kingi or Zingi or something. I don't remember how you say it. Like I said, you work with her in chapter two. Her name was said a billion hey, times. I just that's I no silence. Silence. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay, when it, see, I, I hit the thing. I thought I was gonna say her name. Mm-hmm. It was gonna do a whole ass fucking voice line. Uh, what's going on with her though? Is she? Is she a cyborg? I have no, I think so, yeah, I think so. I think, yeah, I think she's a cyborg. You know, I'm looking at this, and it's just like... You know... Attractive machines already exist in uh, <laughs> Nier Automata. Exactly. With 2B. Uh, this is not Scream, don't put, don't put your dick in the machine. This does not scream that. This screams give it headbats. Hey, and then send it on its way, never to see it again. This guy, this guy ain't even here at his death. Alright, but yeah, you know, looking at this though, it's like, you know, it's... Robotic child. That, that's, that's what I see here. No, so and yeah, you... and yeah, she could probably accidentally kill me with <coughs> with that weapon there because that is a very dangerous type of weapon. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. I, didn't... Of, in, I, I don't I know. I want you to see her in game. She doesn't look very childlike in game. She was one, she was one of the ones that that looked. Oh, like, you don't you don't have to look childlike for me to go. No, you get head bats. Like I like I, I, I she has thick thick ass thighs. Yeah. No, no, it's like, you know, head pads send you on your way, you know? It's... <laughs> like, I'd say this is probably like a high C, low B, maybe. Right. No, no B. There <laughs> Okay, so the next one is... Over that bitch, it's hang on. <laughs> uh, so, the sections. Okay, oh, part of section six. That is... Hoshimi Miyabi. Okay, yeah, she's she's not in game yet, and I don't think she's coming to like. She's 1. a fox girl. One point two or later, yeah. Not for nothing. No, I'm I'm part of fox girls. Oh yeah, she's um not only that, she's also a sword wielder that uses an ice element, or at least she did in the beta. So I don't know if they changed any of that or not. Now to neck. Hmm. Fox girl. Uses a sword. She's pretty. I put her in high A. Yeah. Blue Demon. Uh, what the fuck is her name? Oh, um, I actually have her. She is Sokaku. What's very faction part of? Yeah, very childlike. Um, in my opinion. Oh. Oh, she, oh, she does part of section six. I'm stupid. Horns. Yes. I was actually yeah, uh, excited for her because I thought she was a great sword character, but really she wields like this weird metal giant axe thing. She's fun to play. Fun to play. I'll give her that. She's very fun to play. She's like a heavy weapon user. But 
This just seems like a teenager who was given a license to kill things. Pretty much. I would say... C or lower. We say low C. Yeah. All right, we're on to some more. Uh, a dude. Okay. Uh, you take remember that weapon in Bloodborne? Like it was like the um the drill bit on your arm. Yeah. He he uses that. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's um. Uh, it's here. Anton is his name. Yep. Yeah, I actually have him too. <laughs> I do as well. Uh, he reminds me a lot of Renji from Bleach. I would say it's like a mixture of like Renji and I don't know. You've seen Gun and Logan, haven't you? No. You haven't seen Gun. Okay, next one of these days, I, you and I are going to watch the entirety of Gun and Logan in one setting. Okay. Do because there's a character in Gun and Logan who has a uh, hair like bright yellow hair that stands upright. He's really bombastic. Right. Uh, and I feel like. Renji and this character mixed together creates Anton. Okay. So like, also, like I like his design. Right. Short sleeves with a with a normally with a coat over the top. A weapon that uh, under normal circumstances would probably shatter your fucking arm entirely. <laughs> <laughs> right. Also, another reason why I made the comparison to Gurren Logon that is a drill. Yeah. That is just a drill. Mm -hmm. yeah, so you'll, get a so chance, you know you'll get a chance to play him later on, too. I mean, I, I have him, so. Oh, you got him. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, <laughs> I, I already have this guy. Okay. Uh, I would I would say for him, I'm not going to say A. I would say like mid B. Yeah, well, that sounds fair. Now, are we going to do like low mid or high or high mid? Low mid puts him uh, behind Alexandria. High mid puts him behind uh, Nakamura. No, no, I'll give him over Alexandria. I'll give him over that. Yeah, go ahead and put him next to Neko. That's fine. Alright. Uh, okay. I, I have this other character as well. They're also a lolly. Uh, here we go. Coletta. Coletta. Yeah, Coletta Bellabog. She also uses the hammer. But a much smaller She's... one. She's... Okay. So when you meet her, you'll definitely know she's not a, a lolly kid or anything like that. Because um, she's actually a very high important figure in the game. Um, since you haven't been there, I'm not going to spoil any of that. But she's just... She's wild as hell. Like, the character overall is cute. But... Just, uh, she's the type, you know, if you take her home to mom and mom says something she doesn't like, she's going to break mom's face. <laughs> mm. I see. That's, that's the best way I can describe her. <laughs> where, where would you put her on this tier list? Uh, low B, high C. I'll say high C. Uh, we're on another member of the, uh, of the Victoria housekeeping crew. Yay. This one is Corin Wicks. She's the one with the, with the fucking chainsaw. Yeah. Corin. A soft-spoken maiden, to be sure. Yeah. Definitely cute, um... Very wild gameplay style. Um, actually, very versatile too. She's probably one of the only characters in the game right now that does just physical damage besides uh, Neko. Which is insane, by the way, to have all these other characters. Yeah. <laughs> and have only two of them do physical. No, I think um, I think Billy does physical too, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure 100%. Uh... Oh, I can't check right now because I'm in the mode for cutscene, actually. Right. I was like, yeah, let me check, but I can't, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsies. Corrin. Oh, no. She's. She's definitely a character. Yeah. I. 
I think I'd have to put her with the other. Uh, actually, below Alexandria. Yeah, I was going. to say like a low B. Yeah, I was going to say somewhere low B. Yeah. Uh, Lycon. Mr. Wolfman himself. All right. Lycon, I, I was going to I, say... I've seen Alan Shores. I was going uh, to I say need, anywhere between... Yeah, I was going to say my personal opinion, just because of how unique he is. Anywhere between mid-A and mid-S. I just, would have to agree with you. Yeah. Just because uh, he, he's so different. Okay, so low mid, uh, low mid S or high mid S? Uh, you know, give him high mid S, man. Let him, let him, up, let him up there a bit. He's just and last, different. but not least, Nicole. All right, I'm gonna. Um, I'm actually going to impress you for our finale, Nicole. I'm going to say a B, low B. And, um, a low B. Uh, here, here's why. Here's why. Okay. Here, how here, how low a B are we talking? Hear, hear, hear me out. Okay. And I'll even. I'm talking. Let Nick of Mata be over Nicole. Now here here's why. Nicole's hot. Okay, straight up. But Nicole is just a typical Barbie girl you'd expect. <laughs> like literally, I mean, pink hair. You know, the, the giant boobs. She's the only one you know who has short, tight shorts on, yada, yada. It's like we took we took one hot character and emphasized her, tried to, you know, just go over the top. But really, you just did all the basic normal waifu stuff we always see. Like, yes, she's hot. But she's nothing we haven't seen before. It's like everything we've seen before all collabed into one person. This is when you ask AI to make a like a generally attractive individual. And yeah, that's what that's what and, it was. It's a mix of everything you've already seen. It's just like, oh, I'm not that yeah. impressed by this. <laughs> that is all of the characters currently either in or about to be released in Zen of Stone Zero. Yep. This this is how the tier list ended up. <laughs> when I put this when I put this in the video, I am very curious to see what y'all think. In the comments. <laughs> if any of you say that Ellen de deserves to be an either B or uh, an A or B tier, I'm going to hurt you. <laughs>